We're almost halfway through the year, so we're presenting you with all the releases you can look forward to next month. Here are the upcoming games of July 2020, arranged by release dates. You can find the complete list of upcoming games at our website, whattoplay.com, link in the description below. We're starting off with... Trackmania Nations Remake Ubisoft has big things planned for their Trackmania Nations Remake. More than a decade after its first release, this remake hopes to undo the mistakes of the first game, mainly the fact that it was overrun by ads, and that nobody cared for anything other than their campaign. In this new Trackmania Nations, the first change will be converting it into a live service, which offers daily track selections, frequent updates, and an enhanced track creator. Assuming there won't be any more ads, this will more than make up for their past shortcomings, allowing players to keep coming back for more content even after their amazing campaign experience. Adding a new layer to a game already known for its expansive content, this just might be the change that the title needed and it's coming out on the PC on July 1st. Marvel's Iron Man VR We get to see Tony Stark alive in a different way with the coming of this PS4 exclusive VR title. Put on the famous Iron Man suit and fly through the skies in battles with drones and a ghost from Tony's past. With so many VR games giving people a literally dizzying experience, it makes Marvel's Iron Man feel ambitious thanks to the unpredictable roles and flicks of sky-high combat. We'll see how it actually plays when it comes out on July 3rd. Skater XL Indie developers Easy Day Studios is doing its part to keep the skating genre alive and well. While it might not be the Skate 4 game that we've been looking forward to, Skater XL holds the fort well. With its focus on physics and skateboard simulation, it makes it perfect for skaters and skater enthusiasts that want to recreate real-life tricks in a digital environment. At first glance, its graphics aren't exactly impressive, and the fact that they're skating in empty streets makes it feel like a COVID scenario, but its realistic tricks and smooth physics would make any skate enthusiast curious. Featuring downtown Los Angeles, rush down Broadway, or grind down the rails of their historic sites, all along the roster of true blue skaters. It might have some competition with the Tony Hawk remakes, but this is definitely still worth checking out. It's releasing on PC, PS4, Xbox One, and Switch on July 7th. NASCAR Heat 5 And we have another release that comes with a new season of NASCAR Racing. NASCAR Heat 4 has received some great reviews from players last time, and now we'll see how this latest installment will hold up series expectations. Compared to Heat 4, it doesn't really bring as much to the table, aside from the 34 tracks. Heat 5 will also have two brand new modes in the competitive challenge, and a testing mode that will make perfecting your setups that much easier. Hopefully it delivers when it comes out on PC, PS4, and Xbox One this July 10th. Sword Art Online – Alicization Like Horus The Sword Art Online fanbase has plenty to celebrate, what with the coming of this adaptation of the anime's original storyline. This will be the first time players will get to experience Kirito's adventures in the mysterious virtual world of the Underworld in a brand new light. This may not be the first Sword Art Online game. This will be the first with an all-out experience for anime fans, packed with intense battles, stunning JRPG visuals, and an expansive world to roam around in. But on top of all that, It'll also have a multiplayer mode that lets you play around with up to three different friends. A treat for old fans and you, it's coming out on PC, PS4, and Xbox One on July 10th. F1 2020 The new Formula One season has made its start, so Codemasters follow suit with a spanking new entry for their flagship F1 series. For this year's installment, we'll be taking a look at a handful of new features. The biggest news of all should be the My Team mode, something completely separate from their career mode, and which will take players into the role of drivers slash managers. In My Team, you're expected to be the expert of both being behind the wheel as well as the behind the scenes details of F1 racing management. F1 2020 will also take new leaps forward in terms of handling, offer fixes to some of the connectivity issues of the last entry, and welcome the return of the split screen racing. While we'll witness all of these awesome new features on the latest gen consoles too, PC and current console owners should be happy to take it for a spin on July 10th. Deadly Premonition 2 – A Blessing in Disguise The second installment of Deadly Premonition is almost here, and if its trailer is something to go by, it's about to bring its brand of weirdness into a whole new kind of environment. If Deadly Premonition felt like Twin Peaks meets Resident Evil, 
and this latest entry will blow our minds with its True Detective-like vibe. The trailers don't give too much information, but according to Nintendo Direct, the sequel will connect the series past and present through the story of FBI agent Francis York Morgan, deal with interdimensional elements in a non-linear narrative, and meet some of the characters from the old game. With the first game getting a lot of flack from critics for its awful mechanics, this upcoming installment will hopefully offer a better overall experience. It's coming exclusively to the Switch on July 10th. Story of Seasons, Friends of Mineral Town Having made the original Harvest Moon series, Marvelous jumps at the chance of recreating one of the most beloved titles in Story of Seasons. Improving on the original Game Boy Advance title in almost every way, rediscover the joys of the simple life in Mineral Town. Bring your grandfather's farm back to life and meet some of the original townsfolk, this time with a 3D graphical overhaul and over 20 crop varieties. A new and improved version set to release on the Switch this July 14th. Death Stranding After its most awaited debut on the PlayStation 4, Kojima's latest masterpiece is now headed to the PC to show off the beauty of its shattered world on a new platform. Clearly, beauty is what it's going for on the PC, since with its entrance to the PC comes higher frame rates, ultra widescreen, support, and a new photo mode that seems made for everyone with a 3 monitor setup. It's set to release on July 14th. Did you know? Your reviews can influence the play score. Register now at whattoplay.com and start reviewing games. Link on the description box below. Paper Mario The Origami King Another Mario Classic series is making its entrance to the Switch this year. This Mario RPG has been popular since the N64 days, and this latest game is determined to switch up the formula with a new take on their iconic style. Origami King shows off a more diorama-like approach, with famous Mario characters giving the folded paper makeover. On top of the intriguing new storyline, we're definitely looking forward to seeing it this July 17th. Ghost of Tsushima Perhaps one of the most anticipated games coming this July. This upcoming title from Sucker Punch has grabbed our attention since its first announcement at E3. Through the years, we've slowly gotten to know it better from its cinematic announced trailer to its gameplay debut and eventually its story trailer captured from the PlayStation 4 Pro. But just recently, Sucker Punch gave us a lengthy overview with 18 minutes of gameplay footage, showing off its open-world exploration, combat, customization, and just more of their breathtaking environment and beautiful Japanese flute soundtrack is enough to have us excited to get our hands on it. Ghosts of Tsushima exudes respect for Japan's rich history. It almost feels like a cultural field trip that will be packed with exciting sword fighting and hopefully a compelling storyline through Jin Sakai. We'll see how it all unfolds as it releases exclusively on the PlayStation 4 this July 17th. The rules of the rock. As decreed by Lord Boulder Esquire. Rock of Ages 3, Make and Break. Rock of Ages' third installment is a giant boulder of an entry. Known for their crazy downhill destruction, Make and Break adds a ton of new features to the mix to make destroying their wacky medieval settings even more satisfying. The biggest change should be their new level editor that allows your imagination to run wild. Creating and customizing stages to your heart's content. To add to that is the new multiplayer mode Unleash your inner Terry Gilliam and watch the chaos unfold with up to three different rivals. It's set to release on PC, PS4, Xbox One, and Switch on July 21st. Grounded One of the games from last year's Xbox One showcase, Grounded takes a page out of Honey I Shrunk the Kids, as it tells the story of four kids shrunken down to ant size in the name of science. Aside from giving us a view of our own world in the new perspective, the fact that it's a game from Obsidian should also suggest that we'll get a pretty good narrative experience despite its outlandish premise. Discover an ecosystem of monstrosities in your own backyard, and survive the land with new bases and an arsenal of unique weapons. It's coming out to the PC and Xbox One on July 28th. Ari and the Secret of Seasons Before this game has even officially come out, it's been winning awards left and right. It's an adventure game that's full of heart, telling the story of the young Ariel who has the power to control the seasons. When we first had a look at the game, it felt like it had the charm of Nintendo's Breath of the Wild, 
carrying the same kind of wondrous environment that's packed with creatures to battle and puzzles to solve. With our latest gameplay overview, we got to see a lot of how Ares' world worked. Set in the world of Valdi, we'll get to explore a world separated into four regions, each representing one of the four seasons. But with the world out of balance, it's up to Ari to discover the reason behind the mystery. Seeing just how magical looking the world of Valdi is, there's no doubt we'll have a lot of fun discovering each of its unique corners, and it's coming out on PC, PS4, Xbox One, and the Switch on July 28th. Ari and the Secret of Seasons. Destroy All Humans There's not much that makes Destroy All Humans brand new. That is one of the many memorable cult classics, this remake is a great way of introducing a much-loved title to a brand new generation. A game from the early 2000s but set in much earlier in the 1950s, Black Forest Games remake includes all of the hilarious, satirical antics of their original game. Play is an everyday alien who comes to Earth to terrorize the poor humans on Earth using special alien technology. At its core, it's always been a funny as hell parody, making fun of fun themes like genocide and the Cold War. This remake will offer not just a graphical makeover, but also a polishing of its old mechanics and features. A lot of remakes have come in with the same antiquated controls and mechanics, but hopefully Destroy All Humans will keep up with the pace as it releases on PC and consoles this July 28th.